Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how I create my Winter Bear Christmas card in Procreate and what I did to print it out. Now here is an example of the card printed out. There are fold lines and cut lines so you'll have to fold and cut that yourself. And on the inside you can write a little note. I will have a Procreate file with this card template and a snowflake brush that I created. This is how the snowflake brush will look like. They both will be on my website in the resource library and if you don't have the password for that, you can get that by signing up to my email newsletter. Now here are the layers in the Procreate file. There are cut and fold lines, the front cover, and another layer to the clipping mask and this is where you can draw your card and front cover cut and fold lines so you don't have to do anything about those so those will stay locked and whenever you create a new layer you should turn it into a clipping mask so that everything will show but nothing will get out of the front cover Okay, so now we should start by creating the background of the front cover. So first, select the color. And then select the draw hair layer, then click fill layer. Next, create a new layer. Then turn it into a clipping mask. For this new layer, I'm going to draw the basic shapes for the bear. Well, I'm, I'm going to be using Lisa Glam's character drawing toolkit brushes. But if you don't have those brushes, it's okay because all you really need is simple shapes to create the bear. So now that I have the basic shapes of the bear's head, I'm going to decrease the opacity of the layers to about 50%. To do that, all you have to do is press the letter N that you see in the layers, and that will bring up a menu. Next, I'm going to create a new layer so I can sketch out the outline of the bear by tracing the basic shapes I created. And for the outline, I'm going to use a dry texture brush from Trailhead. I like using a textured brush for the outline because it gives a more hand-drawn look. And you can choose any brush you want. You can use a smooth brush or a textured brush that you have or one of the default Procreate brushes. Now after I have the basic outline of the bear drawn, I'm going to complete it by drawing a scarf, a Christmas hat, and the face of the bear. Now that the basic outline of the bear is complete, we can start coloring in the bear. So create a new layer and just use any brush you want. I like using a texture brush so that's what I'm gonna use. Then you don't have to color in perfectly. You can er erase the little mistakes after. Move your colored layer underneath the outlines so the outline can show above. I also like creating new layers for different colors just so that's easier to clean up mistakes. After we're done coloring the bear, we can start working on the background by adding snow effects and snowflakes. Create a new layer above the background layer. This is where we will keep the snow and snowflakes. 
I'm going to be using an acrylic brush from Nasty Arts Acrylic Brush Stamp Kit and you can use a different brush if you want and you can, or you can just draw little circles where it does now this brush just makes it easier and quicker and the snowflake brush don't forget you can get that from my website from the resource library So after you're done creating the background, create a new layer for your lettering or you can use fonts in Procreate. Um, I'm going to sketch out my lettering first, just a quick sketch and then fix it later. So after I fix my lettering, I'm going to decrease the opacity so I can trace my lettering on a new layer so that it looks cleaner. If you ever want to change the color of your drawing, select a new color, then select the layer and tap on off a lock, then tap the layer again and hit fill layer. And that should change the color of the drawing. Okay, so when you are ready to print your card, hit the two icon next to gallery at the top, then select chair and hit PDF. And I select best quality and I select print. But if you can't print from your iPad, you can send it to your email or save it to files which will save it to your iCloud drive or you can also save it to your Dropbox and then print from your computer and if you do send it to your computer just make sure to select 100% scale and that is how you can create and print a card using Procreate and once again you can find this free appropriate file and my snowflake brush on my website and I will list a link to every brush mentioned in this video and if you enjoyed this tutorial please hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching!